Hey guys, thanks for tuning in to Poppy Eats. Today I went to Popeyes to get their new, well not new, their returning chicken nuggets, except they didn't have them here. In fact, I was immediately told we never had chicken nuggets. Apparently they had them like eight years ago, or maybe even a couple, and they brought them back. I don't know. I haven't seen much on them. That Dame Drops guy did a video, I saw that pop up in my feed. I was like, ah, oh, I'll go try those. They don't have them. Maybe they're coming out. I don't know. Don't don't go seek them out. Anyways, they also have a new chocolate beignets, or as the girl told me, chocolate beignets, <laughs> dessert, um, which I had to wait 10 minutes for them to make. Sorry, we had to make your chocolate beignets. Anyways, a beignet is like uh, their chocolate. Hold on a second. That's supposed to be three pieces. They are. They're tiny. It's a deep fried pastry dough um, covered in powdered sugar. It's, you know, Popeyes, Louisiana Kitchen, New Orleans, French Creole stuff. Beignets are huge down there. I had them when I was visiting. They were like, oh, we gotta get you some beignets. I'm like, sure, fried dough, sweet. I also got the spicy chicken sandwich to re-review. So we're gonna try that first. If uh, you recall, if you've been a long time watcher, you know the first time I had it, I thought it was good but it didn't blow me away. I've had it since, and it did blow me away, but I wasn't doing that on camera. So let's see how this location did with their order. First off, looks good, looks great, looks super breaded. That's what I like to see out of it. Um, but you know what, let's get you Let's get you the right thumbnail in the chair. We got the sandwich and we got the beignets. Cool. Alright, so. Popeye spicy chicken sandwich. You got the same filet, I believe, but it also has that spicy sauce on the bottom. And it's got pickles. So, let's dig in. That's good. When they do that right, with all that breading and that spicy sauce, so good. There's so much chicken in there. Um, I'm willing to say it's better than Chick Fil A. I am. I love a spicy sandwich from Chick Fil A. Their regular sandwich, <clears throat> man, I didn't get a drink. This was a mistake. It is spicy. Um, the regular sandwich at Chick-fil-A, I will say is better than the regular sandwich from Popeye's. It's more flavor. But this spicy sandwich has more flavor, more crunch, more bigger, better pickles than Chick-fil-A spicy sandwich. Hands down. That's a good sandwich. <laughs> hmm. So, A plus, well done. Worth the 20 minute drive I took here. And the 10 minute wait. For my chocolate beignets. So yeah, I guess these ones are full of chocolate or something. Oh, it's gonna be messy. They actually have a promotional hoodie you can get from Popeyes right now, like 35 bucks. And it's a black hoodie covered in like, it looks like it's covered in powdered sugar. So you can get powdered sugar on you and nobody will question it. So I, this might've been like two bucks for three of them. Here's what that looks like. It's a little fried dough covered in chocolate sugar or sorry, covered in powdered sugar. But it's super warm, so I think the inside is just full of chocolate. So, let's dig in. Mm-hmm. <laughs> it's everywhere. Super good. It's a crunchy, doughy outside. It's chocolatey goop on the inside here. And that powdered sugar, which is probably all over my face. I can't even tell on the camera here. 
I'm gonna save the rest of those for dinner. I'm watching my calories here. This is not the food to be eating for that, but I'll probably share the other ones. We'll see how those reheat. But pretty good for, I think it was two bucks. Do I have the receipt? I know. I think it was two bucks for three of them. But there were other options. I don't know what your location's doing. Definitely recommend them if you're getting Popeyes. It's, uh, it's really good. It's really unique. You can't get that anywhere else for like a fast food dessert. Like fried dough? Full of chocolate? Crazy. So yeah, check that out. Pair that up with your spicy sandwich. Um, I'm gonna finish that now, but that's the review. Um, I typically like to talk before and after my reviews if you're new to the channel here. Um, I had a comment today, a couple comments kind of pissed me off. Let's get into that. My guess is the guy's not watching this, but you know what? If he is, we'll see. Let's see what he thinks. I did the uh, cluck sandwich from Jack in the Box, and I like to talk before and after, right? So dude's comment, get to the tasting part, we don't need to hear the extra cluck, LOL. <laughs> well, you know what? Go cluck yourself, um, because go watch a different video. Go watch uh, Peep This Out or Endorsement or I've never seen Dame Drops. Maybe he just gets to it. I don't know. Go watch one of these reviewers that just get to the product. That's not me. So I'm not going to be just skipping the extra cluck, as he puts it. Um, and then he immediately goes to the Spicy Cluck review. Stick to filming as soon as you get your food. No. Bye. <sighs> I mean, I, I guess I appreciate criticisms. That's a little much and a little blunt. That's that's not my channel. I don't just get to the food. Um, I don't know. Now, if you were like, hey, have you considered turning your camera angle? Or, I don't know, something different or kicking up your exposure? Things like that. I'd, I'd love the hair, but yeah. Work is going today. Um, I really don't have time to talk to you because it took so long to get this food and it took so long to get here. I really wanted those nuggets. That pissed me off. I was like, well, we never had nuggets. Get out of here. But I guess, how would they know? How would they know? They'll know when they show up on the menu. Right? If they show up on the menu, I don't know why the Dame Drops guy had them. Ooh, that cop's not happy. He was stopped at a light and he saw something. Ah, oh, that guy must have ran a red. <laughs> yeah, don't do that if there's a cop there. I run the hell out of a red light. I haven't come across that yet. That would do me in. Oh well. Um, kind of cool up here. So this is in a town called Boiling Springs. This is way further north than where I'm working. But they've got a thing here. There's Marco's Pizza, which I've never had. Actually, I think we have that where I'm working. There's also a Salsa Rita's. I've only had that once. Because they had it on the campus of uh, Rochester Institute of Technology, back up where I'm from. But it's like burrito bowls, burritos, etc., etc. I wasn't blown away by it, but I might give it another shot. So, yeah, look forward to that. That one's coming. Um, unless there's something new, I probably won't have a video tomorrow. I'm going to try to do the Monday, Wednesday, Friday thing. Unless there's a new drop from, like, Taco Bell. They do Thursdays. So we'll see how that goes. I'm going to wrap this up, rush back to work. Thanks for watching. 
you know I really appreciate it if you're here. And if uh, you're new, if you want to see more, please hit that subscribe button. Let me know in the comments what you thought. Um, yeah, it really means a lot to me. Thanks for watching. Take care, guys.